What's going on, YouTube? We're here at House of Champions. I'm Billy Brake interviewing Jackie Bernal. Just yeah. coming off getting. What'd you do? What'd you do this weekend? Uh, got second at a Tulsa, I think. Tulsa Regionals. Yeah. I feel like we did this like last week after you won a San Antonio Regional, right? Uh, sure. But that was a different, a different month, a different format, brand new format, first regional, of the new format. And what did you play? Uh, same thing, except that <laughs> if you think that this deck is good in any way, shape, or form, uh, you are mistaken. It should go watch a different deck. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there's a little disclaimer, but no, yeah, so yeah, we didn't play new format too much. We kind of just took the Infernoid deck and we're like, what happened on the ban list? Yeah. We got to cut a rat in a maxi. Basically, what happened was Billy and I arrived at the regional about like 30 minutes before registration happened, not having our decks ready in any way, shape, so we just threw this together. All right. And that's All essentially right. what happened. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, some things left out. But it's good enough to get you there, but all right, let's go to the deck profile. Uh, so we got three of any card in your deck. Mm, any effect in you go. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, any relevant <laughs> effect that you need to do something, it gets the job done. Three of a uh, please don't have artifact card set guy. Uh, two, uh, Paleozoic suck guy. And all of uh, Two more very Paleozoic suck guy. Our nuts is real good. Yeah. Uh, two... This guy doesn't ever resolve ever, really, but if he does, it's lit. I resolved him twice against the, <laughs> that, what is it, the Invoked deck. He's really good against Invoke, randomly. He's up for clearing the way before you make yeah, the big Yeah, because he just kills the stupid 2500 attack guy, and you just banish your spell, and then their deck sucks <laughs> even more. <laughs> Two Harmadick guy. Uh, <laughs> one... One of the best Infernoid ever printed. This guy's crazy. Uh, Sajet. He's, he's just ugly. He just doesn't deserve to <laughs> just have the terrible effect he has. Stay in the deck. Um, one entree. He's thick. He's very uh, thick. Now, for uh, the part where you think the deck can get better, <laughs> it definitely gets better because we got the triple whip tail going. The we have two rep here, but you know... Uh, since uh, you know we go through this combo, you see that there's no Luna Light guys, and uh, we had a very tough time having uh, very good boards, um, except the fact that our Dridents were always so thick. Oh my God, Dridents was always at like what th 30, 36. 36, and it just we just basically played a Dridents game or a Whiptail game. <laughs> When we did a rat combo and we didn't have Patrulli or anything, just gotta float. you kind of just tributed it up for Decatron's effects negating stuff. So he's always just like a chump blogger. You can honestly just throw these to the side and call it a 58 card. <laughs> but my god, was playing Luna Light not a mistake or just not playing like anything else or just not cutting the rat in general, which is yeah. what we should have done is cut the rat. Still um, dried. <laughs> three. Three uh, Terra Top, and then one um, Brick Guy. <laughs> one Maxi. Good God, he did not deserve the fate that he had. And if you're asking if I drew Maxi at my 60 card deck, <laughs> I did once. Uh, uh, one only one. I drew it one time. It was against Magic Specters. I was like, man, what a waste. I drew it one time against the uh, BA. <laughs> <laughs> a timely arrival. <laughs> Uh, and then three fairy tale snow. Best card. And if you think the deck profile stops there because you tuned in last week and saw that that's where the deck profile ended, you're sadly mistaken because we, <laughs> we put back the sticky icky, the heckin' mad kaiju, the, the mystery kaiju. dust kaiju, and then one ducky. Ducky? Ducky. Turtle? Wait, wait, Kamungus came super, right? Mm, oh, yeah, it's new. I don't think it's, I don't know if it's out yet or not. But. Oh, God, we need to get that super sticky, icky. <laughs> Kamungus, okay, first off, this Kamungus is, like, gross, and he's just, like, really beat up on the corner, because I don't know what happened, but, man. He's loyal. He's he's real loyal, man. He's, he, they call him Sticky Icky, because he sticks to your hand. <laughs> we got three Twin Twister, uh, three Barrage, uh, very standard... <laughs> Three Void Vanishment, this, the same as last week. Good spell cards. Three of a, the only, you know, card that makes this deck good, according to people, but... <laughs> it's just the bonus card. It's just the bonus card. I actually played against, like, a, I don't know how many 60-card decks yesterday. A decent amount, probably. Yeah, it was just a decent... I think I played against four. At least four. one. I, I played against four. Yeah. Shout out to my mans <laughs> that I played last round. We have three Instant Fusion. My God, this card's terrible at three. <laughs> I'm yeah, it's tired not good of drawing the card. Uh, it's, it's definitely just 
Not very good in Infernoid at all. It just doesn't do anything unless you already have rat. If you have rat, you're like winning already. I don't know. It just it was just real bad. I hated it. I hate drowning. <laughs> the, the card's terrible. Uh, in two, Infernoid. Uh, interrupted Kaiji Slumber Billy and I, after turning in our deck list, we were like, God, we forgot to cite the third Slumber, and then until round six, someone heard us saying that, and then they're like, Slumber's at two, and we just said, Oops, my bad, thank God we didn't cite that third. <laughs> that could have ended poorly. <laughs> we have two imagination, uh, <laughs> one book of moons, one, one for one, and <laughs> the, <laughs> the fist spice of the weekend. <laughs> Future fusion. Um, did you ever resolve this card's effect? In fact, I did uh, resolve this card's effect. I drew it twice. One time, um, I drew the unknown super turn, so I couldn't like uh, send for future fusion. Mm -hmm. um, and the other time was against uh, mm, Billy. I'm pretty sure it was against you. Oh, was it? Yeah. yeah and then I ended up resolving it and, and sent every single one burned in my deck to the graveyard. Yeah, that was unfortunate. Um. Then we have three Void Feast, and then if you think this is going to be a Swords of Concealing Light, no, sorry to disappoint you, it's a freaking Zoo Combo, come on, God. Mm -hmm. <laughs> solid 60. Solid, solid 60. Um, known for the, we always got the Cyframe, Lord Omega, don't just call him Omega, guys. Uh, Omega. One Tierra, one uh, Norton. Norton, God, I hate that guy. <laughs> uh, one Invoker, one Totem Bird, never made this one time. Ever. Uh, then we cut the zoo package down to one tiger mortar because you're never going to use mm. it more than once. Usually all this was doing was making everything else really thick. Our whiptails were never going away. <laughs> Our whiptails were always coming. And roll back the ones that Surge leave one in there to attach it. Really <laughs> That's thick. Basically, yeah. what, the, basically the combo of the weekend was like, you know, invoker for whiptail, go broad bowl, pull, and then search for another whiptail and just keep being really thick. <laughs> Oh, sorry. Uh, the one tiger border's here. The, the two bulls and the two dried it. Uh, Emerald, I don't think I made... I made this, I think, once or twice. It's crazy. Never thought I'd say that. Uh, no, hold on. One Gagaga -ga Samurai, because he's still the man. He, he's, I made him more than anything else in my weekend. Weird. Uh, one Kagasuchi. Yeah, I made him a lot more often than I did before. Yeah. Uh, before, I usually just made Emerald. Now, now, I just have to make Kagasuchi. Yeah, because Emerald used to like, set up for a full zoo combo on the following turn. Yeah, and now. Then, oh, oh, now it's just like, you don't have the guys in the graveyard to like put Daigus to Emerald back, so you just have to make Kagasuchi with the Whiptail you search and then be sad. Um, one card Gorgon, <laughs> the Anti-Luminescent Knight, just because everyone thinks that they're playing the correct 60 card deck, which is incorrect, because this card destroys the other 60 card deck, which is nice. Uh, definitely can. It definitely just sits and becomes thick. <laughs> now, this is the, the part where I disclaimered uh, before the video. If you think that this is a gooey side deck or you're trying to have cool things for Denver, mm -hmm. sorry to disappoint you, but I think I just threw we, random we just switched, cards. I think we just switched the side deck and the main deck and... <laughs> <laughs> we're like, oh, no, we're good. We're good to go. We gotta write the deck list. Yeah, yeah like, it's just like, let's go. We gotta turn in our deck. They're telling us to come up. So, our side deck was basically... Hold on, let me... Uh, this was a side deck. And then this was, like, previous side deck. And then this was just random cards <laughs> thrown in. So, we can go with that. Uh, we got... Three lullaby of obedience, because I didn't want to take a battle my deck. <laughs> we, 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 we had to put the kaijus in the main deck, so we wanted to just. It's like we, it's like we just sided. <laughs> we there. just swapped what we had, but I still wanted this. I could take someone's rep here. Didn't ever take anyone's rep here, because I never drew it. <laughs> we have. Two mystical space typhoons, and if you're wondering why these aren't mm. Danko Sekas, it's because Billy and I own two Danko Sekas yeah. between oh, each yeah. other. Still? <laughs> Still. No. <laughs> Trades. Uh, no, no, I just prefer a Misty, and then it always comes in clutch, because I'll always play against Metal Foe or something. Uh, one Imperial Order probably should have been in the main deck, I'm not sure. Every time I drew this card, it was insane, because I always, like... Was it always going first? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> Unfortunately. Uh, 2 DD Crow. It's uh, still good, 2017. Still good. Uh, 3 D Barriers, because like you said, I moved everything from the main deck to the side. We just kind of moved some cards around and ready to sign up. <laughs> we just, we have like eight deck boxes between us. Couldn't throw it into any other box. Didn't want to look for other side deck huh. cards. Then we have the, you know, standard three strike, one warning, because that's actually just a good side deck. <laughs> Solid. You know, we have a... 
you can just basically say that uh, this was the side deck. <laughs> yeah, sort of, yeah, pretty much. Uh, All right, well, the awesome deck seems um, similar to the Fortnite decks we've been seeing. So the ban list didn't change too much, the forbidden list, but... Well, congratulations on getting second again. You're thank on fire. You, you. YCS Denver next week. Are you going to top? Are you going to win? I don't know, man. I've been looks at YCS. As I always make it to the last round and then choke. <laughs> <laughs> well, congratulations on doing so well, and good luck to you at YCS Denver next week. Thank you, thank you.